Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Do you want to sell your domain on Namesheep? This tutorial will walk you throughout the process of listing, managing and selling your domain on Namesheep's marketplace. Follow along for a comprehensive guide and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you can have the full experience. So guys, first thing first, make sure to go ahead and open Namesheep.com. Right after that, you have to sign into your account and of course you have to own a domain in the first place. Having a domain in Namesheep can be pretty, basically pretty um, easy because there is multiple ways to own a domain in it. And especially with their pretty very, very a useful uh, tool that they have for having like multiple deals and very very high discount that can go up till 97% you get a domain on Nimship is a very very easy thing to do and of course very cheap now to have a domain there is two ways either to buy a domain on Nimship or to transfer a domain from another platform for this video I'm gonna only show you how to buy a domain then sell it so for buying the domain you are going to go to the hosts or the main page of Nameship which is the home page and then search for whatever domain you would like to have. For example here CR7 Cristiano and let's simply search if it's available. And as you can see this uh, this domain is actually available for CR7.com. Now what I highly recommend is to go ahead and buy a bunch of extensions, not only one. For example, if in the future, for example, Cristiano Ronaldo wants to get this for whatever reason for his company, then he would like also to buy all the extension with it, so people cannot mistake in his main website with uh, any other websites. And of course, so all these links can link at the end to this main one. Now. Once you try to buy it, click on add to cart and then go through the checkout. I'm not going to explain that since we have made previous videos about them. They are pretty simple so you can understand that pretty fast. Now after you buy a domain, it will be available in the dashboard. So you click on dashboard and open it. Your domain should be right here and you can click on it to view much more details. You can add more years or you can go and manage it. So let's go and manage it. Now this is the domain page and as you can see here on the bottom of the page you will find sell domain and list the domain on the marketplace. So let's click here to save the domain. After that the domain listed on marketplace has a domain privacy subscription. It will be sold along with the domain. Asking price, let's go here and let's add for example $100. As you can see price can be edited once saved. Please note, a flat 10% commission is charged when a domain is sold. So, list period is going to be for 30 days for example. Marketplace information, let's search uh, adult listing, no, and uh, send me an email when it's successfully sold and let's click here to sell domain, as you can see right here. Now, as you can see, you have successfully listed this domain to be sold and it has been pretty easy now if you want to edit anything you can click right here and you will be able to actually edit a couple of things which are basically the adult listing if it is yes or no and this notification bar otherwise nothing else can be edited also here if you clicked on this cancel button you will be able to actually cancel domain listing and the domain that you have listed for sale will no longer be available for selling and it's going to be still be yours for future purposes. Let's do this again with another domain. Let's go right here and let's try to sell this domain as well. As you can see here, this one is for sale and this one is not for sale. So these are the differences. Let's go here and manage and once again, what you should do, go ahead to the bottom of the page and go to other domain settings. Go to sell domain and click on sell domain. After you do so, put your asking price, then list period, then here 
adult listing, send me an email when it is successfully sold, then click on sell domain, and just like that, you have successfully sold your domain, or basically not sold, but put it in marketplace for sale. Once it is sold, they will send you an inbox or notification, so you can understand that you have sold that domain, and you have now the money, so you can use them for other things. And this is a page where the domain will be shown. So if you want, for example, to search for your domain, you can search for it right here. And this is the place where people will bid for domains. As you can see here, uh, there is a lot of biddings. For example, $5 bidding, uh, there is $58 bidding, there is $200, $700, uh, there is $9K, uh, there is like $100. Okay, I think this one, yeah, 100k. So there is various amounts of people that are basically uh, putting a lot of money to actually buy a couple of like uh, domain names. And the most expensive ones right with this are gonna be the actual AI. So the AI will you will see them a lot since everyone is trying to make his own AI and trying to make his page. And basically, the domain AI is pretty much expensive even if you just bought it through the domains so if we go right here if I try to write whatever for example see the same thing Cristiano and I try to find the AI one as you can see the other domains will start from 10, 7, 64 for bot which is AI also 12 for .net but AI and bot they are the most expensive ones since they will start from 64 and 80 dollars so they are pretty much very 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 expensive of course if the incorporation one has also very expensive amounts which is like 100 uh, no, not 100,000, but $1,000. So, yeah, the prices are very, very expensive depending of the domain, depending, of course, on the trend. So, nowadays, the trend, ChatGPT, Midjourney, AI, but so people are basically investing a hell amount of money just to get one domain that ends with AI so they can resell it for a higher price. So you might think of that as well. So think about a domain that might work for an AI and just get it for 80 bucks and you might keep sell it for like 300, 400 or even like these people are selling it for 100,000 or 800,000 or like 6,000, 4,000 as you can see in this page. So you have a higher chance to actually sell the AI domains than any other domains nowadays. So think of that as an opportunity for you. And yeah, this is all the information that I can provide you with, guys. This is very simple. So the way that you can sell your domain on Namecheap is very easy, nothing complicated about it. So I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to share it with your friends and leave a like and subscribe to our channel. And thank you guys a lot for watching. See you guys in the next tutorial.